Good morning. Woo, it's been a while. What's going on, Facebook? How you doing? It's your boy, Tone. Tonify, Tonification, you know. I ain't been around in a while because I've been healing trauma, you know. I started this journey back in February. You go full with it, full scale, you know. Um, healing mental illness, trauma, and emotional blockages, you know, from the energetic body. Um, I'm almost out of it. I'll be telling you guys my full story. It's all coming. Details, books, uh, you name it, everything to herbs, plant medicine, recipes, cooking show, TV show, the whole nine. We're going to go full with it. Anyways, I'm coming to you guys because I am on the way of healing my sacrum. Woo! Root chakra is already healed. And uh, the rest of the chakras are to follow. You guys might not know what that is. What are chakras? What's that shit? Well, you got nerves up and down the spinal cord as well as in the front of the body. You know, starts from the middle of the body at the very bottom, right in between the anus and uh, the genitalia area called a perineum. And then um, right here at the top of the roof of the mouth is another area um, when combined and connected with the tongue and the squeezing of the sphincter muscle. We get to do what's charged, what's called the tube of light. It moves from the crown, the center of our head, all the way through our body, through the spinal cord and central nervous system. It's a little strand, a little tiny cord that flows through the spinal cord. And when we get blockages uh, to the nerves in the spinal cord, they disrupt the flow to the, pl um, to the plasma, the dura matter the lifeline, the blood flow, the prana that flows from the brain um, down into our sacral area, also known as gonads, where our hormones are produced, uh, testosterone, estrogen, serotonin, all our dopamines, all that stuff. If you're a man, it's built in our balls. If you're a woman, it's built in your balls too. Yeah, women have balls. Yep, they're located somewhere up here above the area, right around where the femoral arteries are. They're called gonads. Everything we need to have healthy brain functioning starts there through the dieting of our food and can become blocked when the sacrum becomes um, ruptured. Um, what does that mean, a ruptured sacrum? What is my sacrum? Um, Sacrum is the area around your genitalia. Sacral, meaning sacred. Sacred area. Sacred area of energy. Well, there's the science 101. So I got some pictures on here I'm going to be showing you guys. But uh, pretty much what's going on is I'm healing. And my body just released a bunch of inflammation. I mean a bunch. And it hurts so bad that it can't, you know, what is in has to come out. When the pain leaves the body, it has to come out some type of way. Either by throwing up, sweating, or through urination as well as defecation. Well, I don't think I've been sweating enough. Um, so the other day I exploded. Um, my body was releasing all the fear, the pain, guilt, shame, all the seven deadly sins purging my body from these herbs I've been taking, um, natural diuretics. Um, herbal infused coconut oils they're all working as you see my skin's glowing shining i'm fine sexy as hell as ever than i've ever been in my life well almost how about <laughs> nothing like being youthful um skin's clear all that no pimples no nothing no brave rashes lost all kinds of weight lost about 60 pounds through this whole process and um this morning my stomach started rumbling and I was like, no, it feels like that thing that happened the other day when my tummy exploded and everything was really hot. And I was like, spirit, God, Joshua, Oris, higher self, me, God, what do we do? And I hear, get you some mint. So I go outside on a nature walk and I'm told to pick up three plants. And the three plants I pick up is none other than lavender, a new plant that I've never heard of. I've seen it everywhere. And um, was interested. I was actually on the phone with my mom when I walked up on it and said, this plant helps irritable bowel syndrome. And I knew that without ever seeing this plant before. And uh, then I looked it up. Plectrethanius canius roth. 
and uh, some lavender and some yellow rose. So here's what they look like. I got some boiling water right there because I'm finna dip them really quick just to cleanse them. So I'm throwing them in there, not trying to really cook them right now. Just trying to give it a little cleanse. So that anything that's on there that doesn't belong, I won't drink and get sick and die, you know, from bugs. So there it is there. Um, I'll go ahead and put the phone down for a minute. Let it focus on me. You know what I'm talking about? From somewhere in this house. Ajax was here. Flipping the camera is crazy. Because there we go. So I gotta go ahead and straighten that before I lose the herbal medicinal properties. So bam. Might have left it in there a little too long. Looks like all the critters came off. That's pretty good. I'm gonna keep the water. I'm just gonna strain the critters. So, ah, there we go. Boil that like so. And there you have it, you guys. I'm gonna make tea out of that. I'm gonna add some green tea to this. A little bit of brown sugar and pretty much I'll be I posted I'll be posting on here what it's for but um, it helps to get rid of all inflammation throughout the body from the head of the top of the head all the way down to the feet um, this uh, Plectanius canius Roth plant it's a bad mamma jamma it's been around for centuries it grows wild in our natural environment the city plants it everywhere they actually plant all kind of medicine everywhere, I've noticed, and we don't know. Um, it's flu season, cold season. The Plectinius Roth is one of the number one plants in treating cold and flu when combined with rose and lavender. Um, it's, part, it's from the mint family. It's one of the strongest mints. It's used in India, and it's highly, highly used in India um, for helping to lose weight um, because... It clears so much inflammation out of the body and sugar, fat, diabetes, um, all those things, cancer, they all need inflammation to feed on. And that's why this is one of the most highly sought out plants because it kills all that stuff and it flushes it out the body. So anyway, that's enough for me. Love you guys. Here's to my health. Here's to your health in the future. I'll have this for sale someday.